Hey there, music lovers. Welcome back to another deep dive into the world of rock and roll, where we explore the stories behind the legends and the tracks that have shaped the music landscape. Today, I've got a special snippet for all you rock and roll aficionados. We're going to uncover a fascinating tidbit about one of the most iconic figures in music history. It's about none other than the legendary Paul McCartney and his surprising pick for the best Bob Dylan song. You might think you know what it is, but prepare to be surprised. So let's dive into this musical journey. Imagine this, a room full of rock's greatest talents, each picking their favorite Dylan track. It's like a dream scenario for any music lover. Picture the scene, legends of rock and roll, each with their own unique tastes and experiences, coming together to celebrate the genius of Bob Dylan. Names like David Crosby, Richard Thompson, and even Sheryl Crow shared their picks, each choice reflecting their personal connection to Dylan's vast and varied catalog. But when Sir Paul McCartney, a titan in the music world, speaks up, everyone listens. His influence and legacy in music are unparalleled, making his opinion particularly intriguing. Now, you might be thinking he'd go for a classic like Like a Rolling Stone or Blowin' in the Wind, right? These songs are iconic and have left an indelible mark on music history. Well, think again, McCartney's all-time favorite, Mr. Tambourine Man. Yes, that's the one. A song that might not be the first to come to mind for many, but it holds a special place in McCartney's heart. Interestingly, Bob Dylan never released Mr. Tambourine Man as a single. Instead, it was the Birds who took this song, added their own magic, and soared to the top of the charts in 1965. This cover bridged the gap between folk and rock, marking a pivotal moment in music history. The Birds' rendition brought a new dimension to the song, making it accessible to a wider audience. So, why does this song resonate so much with McCartney? While he hasn't spilled all the beans, it's clear that the poetic lyrics and the melodious harmony struck a chord with him, much as they have with millions around the world. The song's lyrics, filled with vivid imagery and a sense of longing, combined with its haunting melody, create a timeless piece that transcends generations. It's a song that captures the essence of an era, a melody that feels like a gentle yet profound revolution. McCartney's appreciation for Mr. Tambourine Man highlights his deep understanding and connection to the art of songwriting. It's a testament to Dylan's ability to craft songs that resonate on a deeply personal level. While McCartney hasn't detailed every reason for his choice, we can speculate that the song's introspective nature and its ability to evoke a sense of wonder and introspection play a significant role. It's a song that invites listeners to embark on a journey, to explore their own thoughts and emotions, much like the way McCartney's own music has done for decades. The connection between these two musical giants is a beautiful reminder of the power of music to inspire and connect us all. Now I want to hear from you. What's your favorite Bob Dylan song and why? Is it one of his well-known hits or perhaps a hidden gem that speaks to you on a personal level? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Let's celebrate the incredible legacy of Bob Dylan and the songs that have touched our lives. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more rocking content. Your support helps us bring you more stories from the world of music. And remember, keep the rock rolling. Music is a journey, and we're all in this together, exploring the sounds and stories that shape our world. Until next time, keep the spirit of rock alive and let the music play on.